I'm going to be installing a wireless home office alarm system. Keep watching the video, I'll show you how we do it. How's it going guys? It's Jeff Lepard from JeffLepard.com and on this channel we do vacation videos, do-it-yourself videos, and much much more. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. So I'm really excited. I just got this home office standalone alarm system by Kerwi and um, I'm going to be opening it up and installing it. Uh, the good thing about these systems that I've heard that it comes complete with batteries and it's completely wireless so it's very very easy to install. So I'm going to set it down on the table and uh, let's take a look at what we got inside. Okay, so it's nicely packaged so let's take out these. These are going to be the motion detectors. I'll, uh, I'll open that up and just set that aside for you guys. Okay, we got some brackets. And here we go. And comes with two remotes. It's got a nice uh, protection uh, cover here. Also a little antenna if you uh, need to get a little uh, extension on the uh, frequency. And these are your door window sensors. And they all come with batteries as well. And of course your siren and this is actually the brain of the alarm. So this is going to be talking back and forth to the sensors. And of course we got our power adapter. So I'm going to open everything out in the boxes, set it all up, and I'm going to show you how to set the alarm system up. So this alarm system supports up to 30 wireless sensors. You can hook up 30 different sensors to this uh, unit, 8 remote controls, and 4 wireless doorbells sold separately. Uh, the distance between the sensors are about 50 meters depending on what you have in the middle if you have a barrier or a wall that's going to make uh, significantly change the amount of distance but uh, a clear uh, view distance would be 50 meters and um, the alarm the actual siren is about a 120 decibel alarm system some of them are 100 to 10 to 120 so it's a, a nice loud uh, siren so before we can set this up, we have to pull the battery tabs. They all include batteries on the sensors and the motion sensors. So what I need to do is, um, the remotes are ready to go, but the door and window sensors need to be opened up at the back. And to do this, you just need to get your finger in here. And I'm just going to pull the back door cover off. And you see there's already a alkaline 23 amp 12 volt battery but there's a tab here so this tab here I just have to pull that tab out and then the light activates and I'm gonna put the cover back on and then we're ready to go for this sensor so I'm gonna do that for the other two sensors and the motion sensor let's do that so here you just need to get a pen or something just to press the back down so you can slide the back open. Just get something uh, that you can open that up with. And there we go. So there is a nine volt battery included. So all you need to do is just uh, hook up your connections here, like so. So I'm gonna tuck that back in and snap the cover back on. If you're interested in purchasing one of these, I'm going to leave a link down below for you guys to check it out and maybe purchase one. The system comes fully programmed and all you have to do is pull the tabs and we've already done that and we're ready to begin. So we're going to plug it in, test it out and then we're going to uh, install it and uh, check the system out. So I've got power already here, okay we've already plugged it in. 
So let's uh, let's try the remote just to make sure that it's talking. Okay, unlock, lock. That one works. Lock, unlock. That works. So let's arm the system and let's check this system to see if it uh, the sensor works. Okay, so here we go. And that works. And let's check the motion. There's a on and off switch at the side here. So let's turn this on and you'll see a red light. And uh, let's arm the system. Works great. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to install the window door sensor. We're going to use it on the door, and I'm going to install the motion sensor, and I'm going to check the uh, alarm out and see how it works. The first part of the installation, I'm going to mount the siren. So right now I'm in my basement. That's the location I've chosen to put this. It's so loud, it doesn't really matter where you put the siren. It's quite audible. So I'm just going to mount it on this joist here. I've got, uh, I've got a screw. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, use my drill and uh, just going to fix that to the, uh, to the joist. And then um, we should be good to go with the, uh, the next step. So, I'm just going to put that in here. Plug that in. Okay, on to the next. The next thing I'm going to install is the door sensor. So, it's already activated. You can see it's a reading. So, what you want to do is, it comes with double-sided tape. Just make sure the surface is clean before you're sticking that. And I'm going to install this uh, right about here so that when the doors open, it's going to be activated. So I'm going to stick this one on first. Just going to use the double sided tape that it came with. Okay, peel the one side, stick that on. Okay, and then peel the the other tape, like so. Okay, so this is going to go right about there. Next is the actual sensor. So let's peel the tape on this side. Okay, stick that on, press down firm and then peel the other side. And I'm gonna put that right about here. And press, not going anywhere. Let's just check to make sure that that works. Okay, we got a light, so that means that it is reading. Now let's move on to the motion sensor. Ready to install the motion sensor. On the back here, it came with a little ball clip that's so you can adjust. So you, what you want to do, you just want to clip that in, like so. And I'm going to just mount the bracket where I want this to go. So I'm just going to put this down for a second. Got my drill. Okay, and what I want to do is I just want to capture any motion coming up and down the stairs and if any buddy came through any of the basement windows and didn't trigger any kind of entry on the doors that they would trigger the motion. So that's why I'm installing this uh, right here. This is where we're going to put it. Okay, that's in there. Okay, let's put the drill down. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to you see the ball here? That's you're just gonna have to firmly press, and it's gonna set in. So, just like that, you'll hear it click. Now you can adjust the motion. And if you have any rain trouble, range trouble, you can, uh, you know, lift the antenna up or not. We'll try it down first. Okay, and that looks right about that. So uh, let's go upstairs and let's uh, check the system out. Okay, so we're at the front door. 
and we're ready to test the system out and by doing so we're just going to arm the system so we're going to hit this button right here okay we heard the beep so all the sensors should be armed so if this door was breached or broken open it should sound as soon as i open it up there you go and to stop it we'll just hit the unlock button also with the uh the remote if you want the alarm to sound in a panic you just uh hit this bell here and that'll sound the alarm okay unlock let's go check out the motion so i'm gonna arm the system okay so anytime i move now this should pick it up works perfect so that's it that's the installation of this if you want to purchase one of these don't forget i'm leaving a link down below for you guys to check it out and maybe purchase one very easy to install wireless completely easy you can do it if i can do it you can do it too so just want to thank you for watching the video don't forget to hit that subscribe button bash that bell to turn notifications on for all of the upcoming videos give us a thumbs up and like our video share our video leave a comment down below and we'll see you next time from jefflepard.com take care guys bye bye